Oh, good morning, everybody. I am feeling so fresh. I've literally just got out of the shower. I'll just talk you through my morning firstly, hold on. So it's now is, what, half past nine in the morning. Let me turn on my baby monitor, actually, two secs. Snoring away. But yeah, it's half past nine now. So I've done the school run, Leo is in school, um, and then Cooper is having his morning nap. And as soon as I put him in his cot, I jumped in the shower. I just, I'm having a bit of a TLC day today. I just put on my Instagram stories earlier that I'm not looking at my phone today. I've signed off my phone today. Yesterday, I feel like I was on my phone all day. God knows what my screen time was yesterday. I just had loads of content to film, some for me, some for another brand. And just feel like I was literally staring at that little rectangle all day to the point where I got up this morning, looked at my phone and thought, I'm actually just sick of the sight of it. <laughs> yeah I just said that I was signing off which is healthy to do um anyway isn't it every few days once in a while whatever so that's nice I feel really zen about that and then I thought I was on the school run and I thought I'm gonna come home I'm gonna jump straight in the shower I'm gonna put on a purple mask I feel like my hair was like yellowing a little bit uh, which my hair has a tendency to do so I put on some purple like toner and left it on for ages, went and put like all the washing away while I had it on, so I knew I'd had it on for a while. Did a bit of um, a little teeth whitening top up, then I got out of the shower and did a full on cleanse, moisturize. I've got loads of lovely moisturizer on, eye cream on, put some serum on my lashes, I'm trying to grow back. Um, yeah, I haven't got a smidge of fake tan on, as you can see, but this was necessary yeah and then obviously got dressed and came down here so that's where i'm at today today is a, a good day we've had a really good start to today even though even though i was awake at 4 45 a.m that is what time my son decided was an acceptable time to wake up today so that can really put you in a spin and put you off on like a bad start but I really put in the effort to switch that up and I feel like I successfully have done that. Now he's obviously sleeping, he'll be asleep for like an hour, hour and a half. He's already been asleep for half an hour so yeah he has a couple of hours in the morning. And my plan is to sit here, I'm going to open my laptop, I have, I have got a little bit of emails and admin and stuff to do but you know what, I love starting my day doing that, it's part of my routine so I'm going to open my laptop, I'm going to put on kardashians i've got it ready to go ready to press play and do you know what i mean if you're a subscriber you know me i cannot stand the sight of stuff like this normally i'd be on my hands and knees putting all this away before i do anything but i ain't doing it not today he'll only come down and make all the mess again anyway and i never say that <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it and actually when he does wake up we are going straight to a play group so we have a play group this morning that my mum also goes to with my niece and we went for the first time last week he loved it we're going again this week so we'll go there like as soon as he wakes up then maybe we'll hang out with my mum for a little bit have some lunch he'll come back here have his afternoon nap I can have a bit more zen time and then it will be school run time and after the school run we actually have the dentist today um i broke the news to leo just before the school run i didn't, didn't know how he'd react but actually seemed like weirdly excited about it so so there you go i just need my daily dose of caffeine i don't drink tea or coffee i know like am i even a real mum i don't know so my daily dose of caffeine looks like this and i am just gonna put this away hold on i'll show you this this is really cute wait so every morning before school leo has to write a sentence so i stick in a picture every day look the spider is crawling <laughs> how cute is that <laughs> a monster is eating a sausage so cute so yeah every day i put in a picture and he writes a sentence and yeah that's like our little morning routine before he goes to school so he has his little sound mat and his tricky word mat and they'll just go in there and i'll put this away tell a lie i have actually just remembered that i do have 
something to do on my phone. I was hoping to barely look at my phone today, but I do have something to do. So basically I was creating content for a brand um, yesterday and the brand has come back and said that I have forgotten to mention something that needs to be mentioned in the video. So I need to edit it and I need to add that in. That is part and parcel of um, creating ads and content for brands really often they will come back to you and say that they need it tweaked here or that you haven't used correct vocabulary or you've missed out um, a key step or something like that so it's really normal for stuff to be bounced back to you um, you would have to jig it and send it back so that is something that i need to do but after i do that i'm not doing anything else on my phone so i will actually do that now first thing i'll definitely do it with the kardashians in the background like Kim K can just be chatting to me in the background while I get this done. Hello. Is there a baby boy in here? Hello, Angel. Look, he's awake. <laughs> Hello, Angel. <laughs> Now you're so happy. Oh my gosh. So he is awake um, just in time as well. So it's half past 10. Playgroup starts at half 10. So we will be late, but we'll still get to most of it. So that's good. So, oh my goodness. I'm going to pack. <laughs> I'm going to pack my bag. Oh, I'm going to pack my bag. Um, put some lunchy bits in there for him. I made in these sweet potato fritters last night and put a spare one in the fridge. So I'm just going to put that in a little lunchbox with some other bits and um, we'll be good to go. We'll be okay. Yeah? And Grandma will be back. We'll see Grandma. Now you just play down here for a minute while I get ready, okay? Also, yes, I am going with wet hair. I don't want to blow dry it because it will just make it go wild. And... I just really don't care. I don't care today. I'm zen. Obviously, I won't really be able to film in playgroup because it will be full of um, other people's children. <laughs> I, do, I do look a bit mad, don't I? But um, yeah, I'll speak to you after. So we are home from Playgroup, uh, which obviously I couldn't really show you, but we went back to my mum's house after. My dad is actually away at the moment, so it was just my mum and my niece who you saw, and we had lunch together. So that was really nice. Well, the kids had lunch anyway. I am having my lunch now. Cooper is upstairs having his afternoon nap. Oh, Trevi. 25 past one it is. So he's having his afternoon nap. I'm having scrambled egg on toast. And I thought I'd come into the living room for the afternoon nap, you know, break up the scenery a little bit, get away from the toys. So yeah, this is my afternoon nap views. Not too shabby at all. Excuse the um, half constructed castle. In the background, that is Leo's homework that we need to finish this weekend. <laughs> And excuse the dirty tray and the tea towel. I just spilt a bit of my precious, precious nectar onto the tray and can't be bothered to clean it properly. I want to sit down and have my lunch. So this is where I'll be until he wakes up. He'll probably, he only sleeps for like an hour in the afternoon. Ooh, it's very zoomed. Let's not do that. So I'm just going to make the most of this precious hour before he wakes up and um, it's all go again. <laughs> oh my God. I just had to come on. I promise I'm not crazy. I had to speak to someone about it because I'm here on my own. <laughs> I've just watched the penultimate episode of This Is Us. 
does anyone out there watch This Is Us? If you don't, please watch it. And there's only two episodes left and I just watched the penultimate one and I cannot stop crying. Oh, I literally can't stop crying. And you're either watching this and you watch This Is Us and you get it, or you're watching this and you don't watch This Is Us and you officially think that I'm insane. <laughs> I never used to cry at TV shows before I had kids. Or just cry in general, really. I wasn't really a crier before I had children. And I'm just terrible for it now. But to be fair, that was really, really, really sad. That episode was horrific. But I, I could cry. I could cry so easily now since I have kids. Anyone else like that? Like sometimes even like thoughts would make me cry. <laughs> oh. But please comment if you have watched episode 17 of the last season of This Is Us. Because I need, I need to talk to someone. Okay, that's like throw me. He's still asleep and this is like time when I could be up like doing something. But he's um it's like totally throw me. I can't move. But in all seriousness, we have obviously got the dentist um after school, so it's two o'clock. I've got an hour now till I need to get Leo. Um and yeah, obviously we will go straight from school to the dentist. And I'll bring a little snack for him to have after the dentist because he's always so hungry after school. And anyone else's kids like absolutely ravenous after school. He comes in and just runs to the snack cupboard, basically. So I better take something with me. Yeah, I'm just waiting for Cooper to wake up now, basically. Like I said, I could be up loading the dishwasher or something like that before he wakes up. But I, I feel like I've just, I feel like I've just been hit by a bus, an emotional bus. Okay, he has woken up. 20 minutes before we need to go get Leo, so that's good timing. Let's go get him. Hello! Hello, my little angel boy! Here he is! <laughs> is that a good sleep? So he always has his afternoon bottle before we go and get Leo from school. So should we make your bottle? And have a little cuddle. Let's put your little cartoons on. Oh, it's loud. Shall we get yeah, what Maca Packer? It's just occurred to me that I'm about to go to a dentist appointment for both myself and Leo, and that Cooper would be with us. <laughs> uh, it hadn't really occurred to me up until that point, and um, yeah, then I was like, what on earth? What am I gonna do with that baby when I'm having my checkup? So, packed a snack. Got a little wafer. So I'm sure I could just hold him on my lap and give him that wafer. And he's pretty much guaranteed not to move then. He's also the sort of baby that just loves to watch stuff. So if he's like sat on me, nibbling on his wafer and the dentist is looking at me, with his tools and things. I can imagine that would um captivate him. Fingers crossed anyway. So yeah, gonna go get Leo, go to the dentist. I'll see you when we get home. No. No. Good boy. Don't mind me, just on the kitchen floor. Trying to get my baby to stay away from the dog bowl. So we're back home from the dentist now. And uh, all was well. Actually, the lovely dental nurse just held Cooper while I had my examination done, so that was um, there was nothing to worry about there. But I, I just look. I'm sorry. I'm looking in the viewfinder like what the actual. What's going on today, Ellie? I mean, we're literally putting this on YouTube, and look at this state here. I'm just yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> teaching you bad habits. Yeah, Dennis went absolutely fine. Well, he told me, he always tells me I've got the same reason. He always tells me I need to floss. He told me I've got the same I don't, I don't floss. Does anyone else always get told off for not flossing at the dentist and I always tell myself, I'll definitely start flossing now. I'm like, I just don't. It just doesn't happen. 
but um, otherwise it's fine. Leo is just absolutely fine. He's just chilling on the sofa with Netflix. At the moment, I won't show you him because he's still got his um, school uniform on there. Yeah, he, he had a good day at school and he's just chilling with a snack. And I'm just doing what I do every day, which is making sure that he doesn't put himself into, into danger. Again. Yay! Cooper's furniture surfing is honestly getting out of control. He started over there by Leo. So he's gone all across the sofa, then across Leo's little table. To get to the dining table, he like moved this chair like a walker to get over to the dining table. Now here he is playing with his wet wipes. Hi. He is just, he's so confident with the furniture surfing, like moving between furniture and stuff. He's so good at that, but we just can't get him to walk on his own. Can we? Well, 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 he can crawl on his own. He can crawl on his own, yeah, that's right. But he just doesn't want to walk, does he? Mm. And I was actually really hoping that he would be walking by um, next week because we are going on holiday to Mallorca and <laughs> he's stuck now. And we're obviously going to be on the beach. And like the thought of him crawling on the beach. Come oh, on, my hand. You got yourself stuck. Come on then. There. Back to the sofa. Yeah, hold on. Good boy. Yeah, the thought of him crawling on the sand like fills me with dread. So I was hoping he'd be walking by by next week, but it's really not looking like that's going to happen. To be honest, he's in a strop because I just cut his toenails. Me cutting toenails. So he's cross. I'm gonna read your magazine. He's also not allowed his iPad out of school, which hasn't helped the situation. I was just, um, I felt, I just felt like it was, he was watching it just too much. So we just made a simple rule that after school, he can only watch it after dinner. So he can watch it in the morning when he wakes up, that's fine. But after school, you can't have it until um, after dinner. And um, yeah, usually he looks. Yeah, I know you don't like that rule, but we've done it because we want you to do other things. And you have been. You've been doing sitting at your table, doing writing, and you've been up in your room sorting out your Pokemon cards, and you go out in the garden, you do lots of other things, and then after dinner you can have it back. Yeah? So I've lost all track of time because the dentist appointment has thrown me completely. It is doo -doo -doo, half past four, so I'm going to turn on the oven and have a little think about what to cook for dinner. So I'm filming this on my phone because I cannot even move him to get up to go and get the camera. So like in the last hour, I think, since I last picked up the camera, I, don't, I literally don't know what happened. You know, one of those like evenings where it all just goes like wrong very very quickly so koopy decided that he was hungry like that so he was perfectly content and then out of the blue it was like screaming um pulling at my legs and stuff and i knew it was because he was hungry and what me and leo were gonna have and i was gonna give him some of as well was gonna take ages so i was like it's not an option so i just gave him a random mismatched dinner so he had this random mishmash dinner then he was happy ish then me and Leo sat down to eat our dinner, which is not how it normally goes. We would normally always have dinner together. So then like Cooper was like, alone on the floor while we were up at the table, which obviously he was furious about. And it's just been very, very emotional. So I ended up eating my dinner, stood up with him on my hip. And we're now cuddling, watching Eagle Pickle. I don't know where, yeah, I don't know where that mood swing came from. Who, who knows with babies? Daddy is home in Two sleeps. Not long. He always asks how many sleeps it is till daddy's home. 
<gasps> which is in two sleeps by the way if you got that <laughs> but anyway honestly yeah that was that was a bit mad i just looking forward to just having a chilled bath time get them in their pajamas get him to bed do some nice reading with leo get him to bed and then i've got some work to do tonight and i was gonna vlog for a bit longer but honestly after that past hour i think i'm done for the day i think you need to know when to switch off and just focus on rounding up the day so i am gonna switch off now <laughs> poor baby thank you so much for watching guys Sorry, it came to a bit of an abrupt end, but thank you so much for watching and we will see you in our next video. Say bye. No, not today.